Avery started showing some signs of like a flu. Within about three days, she started breathing really hard. So we sent her to Children's Close to Home to get some x-rays done. Avery's heart was functioning at about 20-25%. We were told that she was in heart failure. I didn't know that this happened, that kids would be perfectly normal when they were born and then, you know, a year later come up with heart failure. We put her on a lot of medications. Then we had to start talking more seriously about heart transplant. Wait for a heart um, for this age of a child is usually like one to four to six months. We were just hoping that Avery would be able to hang on long enough to get her heart. We discussed it amongst a group of us that the best option for her was gonna be the Berlin Heart. And at two o'clock in the morning, we started do doing all of the paperwork, which is pretty extensive because it is not an FDA approved device. It's a bridge to transplant. So it allows uh, you to get the breathing tube out. It allows the other organs to function as they would be expected to function without getting end organ damage, which helps the lungs recover and the lungs to be in a better shape for a transplant. It gave us hope that we might be able to make it. She was on the Berlin Heart for eight days before a heart became available. Oh my goodness, we got the call at 6.30 in the morning that it was a good match. By this point, we had developed a, a trust with the, the surgeon, Dr. Phillips, and uh, the heart transplant team that uh, we knew that she was in the best hands possible. As soon as they put her heart in and they um, let the blood run, run through her veins. The heart started beating right away. Avi's prognosis is uh, very good. She can go to school, run around, play, do whatever she would like to do. I'll watch her walk across the, the living room and I'll just cry. Avery had a lot of really hard things happen to her. We are just so blessed that everything was set in place for this. The doctors were here, the technology was ready. This is a comprehensive heart center, transplant's one aspect of that, and we have probably hundreds of individuals involved um, from all aspects of care. The doctors that we have here truly do this because they love the children. They love what they do. Mm -hmm.